In recent days, news first revealed the plight of 56 Sri Lankan youth trapped in a cybercrime camp on the Myanmar Thailand border. The Sri Lankan embassy in Myanmar is also racing to secure their release. The camp, chillingly dubbed the Cyber Criminal Area and located just 25 kilometers from the Myanmar town of Miaveddi, is reportedly controlled by a powerful terrorist group, posing significant challenges to the rescue efforts. The Sri Lankan embassy, led by Ambassador Janaka Bandara, has been engaged in intense negotiations with various parties, including the Myanmar Home Affairs Minister. It was as a result of these talks that an agreement was reached for assistance from the Myanmar authorities in facilitating the rescue. The rescue attempt to free 56 Sri Lankan youth trapped in a notorious cybercrime camp in Myanmar has reportedly failed. Revelations from a young man who managed to escape the Thailand-Myanmar-based smuggling ring exposes how aspiring Sri Lankan workers were lured with promises of lucrative IT jobs in Thailand only to smuggle them across the border with tourist visas and force them into the cybercrime camp. This man had managed to escape along with several others. This was the response given to News First by the person identified as Sashika who was also exposed by the young man who spoke to us. අපිට කිව්වේ තායිලන්ඩ් වල බැංකොක් වල තමයි ජොබ් එක තියෙනවා කියලා ඩේටා එන්ට්‍රි ජොබ් එක. අපෙන් ගත්තා ඒකට ලක්ෂ 4 ආමාරක් ගත්තා. ප්‍රභාත් විජේසිංහ කියන එක ආයෙ කවුන්ට නම් බේද තමයි අපිට සල්ලි දාන්න කියලා දුන්නේ. ශෂික තමයි උගේ මේ නම් බේකට දාන්න කියලා. බැංකොක් සිටි එකේ නම් කිලෝමීටර් 30ක් විතර එලියට තමයි වර්ක් ප්ලේස් එක තියෙනවා කිව්වේ. මම විසිට් වීසා වලට තමයි අපි ගෙනි යනවා කිව්වේ. ඊළඟට එහෙන් අපේ වීසා එක ජොබ් වීසා වලට කන්වර්ට් කරලා දෙනවා කියලා කිව්වා. කොහොම හරි අපේ 8 දිනක් කිඳියා එක බැච් එකක 8 දිනක් කිඳියා ගෑල්ල අමෙකුත් ඉදියා. ඔක්කොම එක පාර ගියොත් එහෙම වැඩේ නෝන් शशिकाइलैंडोक लंका you You cannot return as you please without at least visiting the company. You will have to pay for the losses incurred by the company because this company offered free tickets, transport, etc. You have to pay the loss to the company. We have all your details. End quote. Given the alarming details emerging about modern day human trafficking, it is imperative that authorities launch immediate investigations. Given the lives at stake, shouldn't all necessary steps be taken without delay to crush this network that trades Sri Lankan youth for mere 5000 US dollars?